The topic of this video is determining symmetry with respect to the x-axis, y-axis, and the origin. Let's look at a problem. For the equation 49x squared minus y squared equals 49, test for origin symmetry. Okay, we're given an equation and we're told to test for symmetry, so we need to use the SIRS method, copy, erase, replace, simplify. And because we're testing for origin symmetry, when we erase, replace, we're going to erase every x and every y and replace them with a negative x and a negative y, respectively. All right, so first copy. 49x squared minus y squared equals 49. Next, erase. Everywhere you see an x or a y, erase it. Do not erase anything before it, after it, or above it. So, when you erase the x and the y, this is what you get. Next, replace. Each x is going to be replaced with negative x. Each y is going to be replaced with negative y. Next, simplify. You have to follow order of operations here. Exponents, like this 2 and this 2, happen before this subtraction, which means we need to figure out what this is first, and what this is first. Then we'll worry about this 49, this 49, and this subtraction symbol. All right, well, negative x in parentheses squared simply becomes positive x squared. Similarly, this becomes positive y squared. Then all of the things around it happen. So we've got this 49, and this subtraction, and this equals 49. All right, now, is there anything else we can simplify? No, we're done. So our final equation is 49x squared minus y squared equals 49. And when we compare the equation that we started with, to the equation that we ended up with, we find that they are identical. They are the same. Therefore, yes, we have origin symmetry.